hey yeah welcome back again to my youtube channel thank you so much for coming back i really do appreciate you guys so in today's video i'm gonna give you guys a short tour of my dormitory my minimalist room my ghetto my really tiny room but before i start the tour i'm just giving you guys a sneak peek of the outer parts of our dormitory so all these buildings you guys are seeing are like clusters of student hostels and yeah these are bicycles and so let's get right into the video <laughs> um so i'm on the first floor of this building so i'm just climbing up straight to my room then we start our tour now i'm just trying to open the door thank you okay <laughs> here we go then yeah so yeah i have like three neighbors around me yeah i think on my floor we have like um close to 16 people i'm not so sure so welcome to my room <laughs> yeah so here i just hung my coats i'm going to give you guys a proper view that is it so because the room is really small you have to find me some ways and keep your things well so that your room doesn't get too stuffy you know what i mean so that's my red over there and over on the left right hand side i pack my stuff yeah so i pack my things here in the wardrobe i'm not going to show you guys everything it's private then here is the bathroom which i really do not like so as you guys can see the towels are really damaged that's how i met it and they were supposed to come and change it but yeah i'm still waiting for them to come and construct they're supposed to remove all the towels and then you know contract it again and this they are supposed to fix it so my bathroom is really really messy it needs a reconstruction i think the person who used it before me man and my mirror so dirty like i don't think i've ever cleaned my mirror guys <laughs> i'm not going to lie to you guys sometimes i do actually forget that i have a mirror so yeah this is my room we have like shelves where we like we keep stuff so on this shelf i normally like to keep my food need some vitamin c i have my indomie i'm just left with one pack and on the other shelf i like to put like decorative stuff there as you guys can see you no know, so yeah <laughs> these are the things i have like i don't know i don't really have much but yeah my cutlery my calves my teacups the black thing over there is called shito every Ghanaian if you're a Ghanaian you know what's a shito and my mind is my gary obviously nobody you know, have my bowls and these boxes i keep my old um my old books inside okay yeah and in that white rubber i just keep my old bottles because in germany you can recycle the bottles for money so i don't throw them away so i just keep them there and here is my vintage microwave <laughs> It's cute i know and that's my fridge these are my personal stuff right it's not provided by the hostel because the hostel gives us like fridge in the main kitchen so these are my personal stuff and that's my rice cooker and kettle you know and here i have a spare chair just in case you know i have a visitor or i don't feel like sitting on the other chair i use this one and my suitcase is over there because i'm parking um yeah i'm traveling you guys will get to know that soon um yeah a little bit of decoration these are poster cards from new zealand i got it from my friend cute right yeah that's my cuff my shelf small shelf where i keep my like lots of papers and envelopes if you live in germany you you always get like bills and envelopes and all of that so i keep most of the things there and over there is we have unlimited router it's um, for internet so that's the router for internet and yeah that's a christmas hat on my steady lamp <laughs> i don't know why i put it there and that's why i study that's my table i study and then actually my table is right by the window okay so sometimes when i'm studying i like to look outside to like kind of take taking a break or sort of yeah so just for decoration i put my santa claus hat over there mm -hmm. yeah so now yeah my room is sometimes messy i'm not going to lie to you guys i'm going to be real AF, right so i put this pillow on my chair so that my back doesn't really hurt because this chair is comfortable but the back is not so stable 
let's put this big pillow there yeah and that's my view it was night so you could you guys cannot really see like much I'm gonna open the window it was really really cold trust me guys and in germany you see how the windows are wide the windows are so wide that during the summer i can just open the window for fresh air you don't even need to have a fan or ac okay so yeah just trying to open my window for some fresh air right now because the curtain i just don't like opening my curtain my curtains are always closed even during the day my curtains are always closed now as you guys can see my mirror <laughs> so dusty <laughs> oh god i actually most times i forget to have a mirror like i have a busy shadow i really need, do need time to clean my mirrors very very well get a filter or something and that's some a little little decoration i got from woolworth and yeah these are old masks i need to throw away right and this um picture i got it from wall picture i got it from outside i picked it and that's my umbrella hung over there and this i don't know what it is but i just hung it there <laughs> so, yeah and this also this um wallpaper wall picture whatever it's called i also got it from outside it was outside and i picked it it was for free so i just picked it up and at the top top shelf i keep most of my cosmetics there my oils and all of that because the room is like really small you how to find a way of you know really 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 managing it i keep i even keep some of my like my my shoes are under my bed you know i have a, so many shoes i don't even wear some of them so i kept them under my bed so yeah that's my room it's not so nice i'm not a, like a girly girly person who would decorate guys you want apple oops so i was trying to throw the apple and it fell off my hand let's pick it up then <laughs> all right so yeah if, if you know you want the apple just let me know in the comment section i'll just ship it to you wherever you are okay so now um so i'm gonna take you guys to our kitchen it's a shared kitchen like um so uh, we share this this kitchen it's for like i mean like 15 people but trust me most of them don't eat don't even cook just a few people cook so usually the kitchen is is free and then we all have like personal lockers there we keep our stuff and then yeah that's our kitchen we have stove microwave everything is being provided by the hostel but like when it comes to the utensils and everything um you need to buy them okay the kitchen usually the kitchen is really clean but today oh, i filmed on the wrong day yeah we have a sofa and some plants you know yeah lots of white people so <laughs> yeah so that's our kitchen somebody cooked there. the person didn't even clean up and here is the laundry room where you have to pay for laundry two euros and then for drying is one euro fifty cents yeah and it's in one of the hostels so like mm, yeah <laughs> this is where i say thank you guys so much for watching i really do appreciate you guys and i'll see you in my next video ciao ciao choose choose bye bye <laughs>